Hello guys, welcome to my 19th video on C programming. In this video, I will show you how to compare uh, two text files. So let's get started. So here we are going to deal with the files. So put file and a pointer variable f1, comma pointer f2, and an integer a comma b. So now we are going. To, so file is used to either. Uh, write to your text file or a read from a text file so now we shall uh, deal with the writing to your text file so right uh, in order to write something we need to open the file so to open a file is here to open and uh, here place the text file which has to be opened i'm going to put a.txt if this a.txt is not there uh, file uh, the where once the program is executed this a.txt file will be automatically created and here you need to put the mode either to read or write I am going to write something so I put w uh, in the mode and um, assign it to the f1 pointer variable now I am going to print something f pointf uh, here put where uh, the file has to be written in which file so uh, this uh, file is opened in f1 so f1 comma uh, the text uh, to be uh, appended to that uh, file so i am going to put the chips and finally close f1 now, now let me run this program i will show you what happens so this is my uh, this is already so now uh, now you can see that uh, the text file is created now and the text uh, text chips is uh, uh, inserted to this text file uh, okay. now let us deal with read so in order to read just change this to uh, or and this is not necessary for reading and copy this paste change the account to f2 change the text file to g.txt and the mode to read and now here comes the uh, main thing um, now try to open uh, a.txt and b.txt if they are not found then you have to throw a message if f1 is equal to null or f2 is equal to null then throw a message enter cannot read If they are found, then you have to do this else. Uh, and the else is going to have um, a is equal to get character from f1 and b is equal to get character from f2. So now um, uh, get character from f1 and assign it to a get character from f2 and assign it to b in case um, if uh, oh okay now uh, both has uh, some values right uh, if it is true then you have to do this while loop um, uh, get uh, actually this is uh, going to get characters so it will get character and assign it to a so we need to get all the uh, characters in that text file so we need to loop it in order to get all the characters in that text file so do this same process so do this same process until the file reaches the end of file a is not equal to and b is not equal to so that's it so if the if uh, a reaches the end of file or b reaches end of file uh, the while loop terminates 
that's it now we have to uh, and the last thing is we need to check whether the text in this is equal or not if a is equal to b then printf files are equal uh, where is it a not equal to b then print up files or not equal files some crap right now uh, uh, now let me explain to you this actually this a and b is a character now uh, once uh, once the character is uh, get from uh, the f1 pointer it going to hold some numbers so uh, it will check whether the a uh, if it is a 71 if 71 is equal to b uh, uh, b 71 if it is true then files are equal else the files are not equal and if both this uh, if and uh, else if uh, condition to this before this else statement will be printed but uh, most probably this uh, we won't get this message uh, now let me run this program and see what happens this it shows that cannot refer because there is no uh, text file b now let me make a copy and change the text to b and run it once again now it shows that the files are equal now let me make some changes in b and save it try to run this program again it shows that the files are not equal so it's going to uh, get uh, characters each characters uh, each characters from the both the file and assigning to a and checking whether they are equal or not so that's it thank you for watching see you guys in my next video